everybody. It's time for another story. I hope everybody's staying nice and well and I hope everybody's been enjoying this lovely sunshine. I bet some of you have been in the garden playing on your bikes and scooters. So today's story is Norman the slug with the silly shell. See if we can count the words in the title. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I wonder if you could make seven on your fingers. Norman, the slug, thought snails were great. Wow, said Norman. Look at them. They're amazing. Shall we see if we can count the snails? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven snails. But unfortunately, the snails didn't think Norman was great. We crash. Norman, you silly slug, they cried. You've spoilt our fun. This only works if you've got a shell. Norman felt very left out. Sadly, he sulked off into the moonlight. If only I had a shell of my own, he sighed, looking at his reflection. And that's when he had an idea. Maybe I could have a shell after all, he thought. Ooh. I wonder where he's going to get his shell from. But finding the shell was not as easy as it seemed. One was too bouncy. One was too noisy. And one was already taken. Norman needed time to think. Ta-da! A shell! It was perfect! Norman had never been happier. He could join the snails at last. What is it? Is it something we could eat? Looks very colourful. Norman loved being a snail and the snails loved Norman and they loved Norman's silly shell. But the fun didn't last for long. Suddenly there was a loud flapping of wings. <gasps> Look out bird! cried the snails in panic. Quick slither for your lives or we'll end up a supper. Oh, because birds like to eat snails. But the bird was more interested in Norman's silly shell. It looked delicious. Norman was being carried up, up and away, higher and higher into the sky. What could he do? Norman did the only thing a slug could do. He made slime. Lots and lots of it. With a slither and a slother, a slip and a slide, Norman was free. <gasps> wow. But he was falling faster and faster and faster until plonk Norman Norman are you okay asked the snails wow said Norman that was great I love flying if only I had wings ta-da 
he's found himself a pair of wings. And what did he use? His underpants. And that's the end of the story. I hope you've enjoyed it. And Minnie, Big Ted and I will be back for another one soon. Take care.